Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here to start a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series, which we're playing as Metal Mark. I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover, and we got Penny and the Metal Mark retail we'll talk about in a little bit. Everyone's favorite mascot is still here. Just as she is the face of Metal Mark, TM, she's also the name of the sophisticated machine running the whole company network. Though she had two centuries to increase sales, she's had to do so by cutting more and more uh, facilities off, or faculties off, of the original facility leaving them to rot away as her reach gradually declined. However, with the help of some new friends, Middlemark may yet again break shareholder expectations. And we've got a unique focus stream. Middlemark has remained a stalwart beacon of the Calgary community since it pushed out its comp competition in the 2040s, and proud of it. Fully automated and fully stocked. For years, Middlemark has helped the local government within Calgary, which I'm sure I'm saying wrong, from the city uh, from top to bottom. From our patent auto tracking enabling an easy sustainable means of traveling through the inner city at a reasonable fee of course to our various gas stations and sub markets you can count on penny tm to bring you small parts of the future big time our various markets and supply lines have remained intact despite some strange implications of heightened radiation outside whatever the case may be so long as you have our patent middle mark coins or middle mark tickets we have what you need guaranteed where every cent is gold and prices soar what a wonderful place Water and stability. The shelves are so well stocked. Cities are. I sure do hope they don't own the government. Um, so what do we have here unique? We had a couple people to talk about. We definitely are a robotics nation, but our robotics tech actually is not very good. Um, it's actually quite bad. Unit, robot, unit organization is not too bad. Unique things here. Not too much really. How yeah, about cultural advisors back in my day? They're kind of, yeah, dependable agent. Petty officer Ky Kyler Brooker. Earns in our places, and then they get the rest of the normal guys here. Interesting. How about Chief of the Army? Expanding the gang. Stubborn guy. Definitely want this one. Uh, major businesses. So it doesn't seem like... Well, I always like more political power. Scientific devotee is not bad. So, uh, how's our water consumption? It's actually decent. Well, the shelves are so well stocked. The miscounts. Raiders from out in Seattle. Unshackled from their home by force. Now they're happily employed. And let's see. Uh, old grudges, new times. The miscounts never never really gave up, but they'll be employed in Middlemark happily. What's wrong with getting a little in character sometimes? Raiders from out beyond. Today marks a significant day in our company history. For the first time in 198 years, Middlemark is proud to announce the employment of humans once again. With a large influx of migrants from Seattle, our employment rate has absolutely skyrocketed, and we already have the number one employee in the, or employer in the or we are the number one employer in the Canadian prairies. Please note that any and all new personnel required to wear badges at all times are on company property for the purpose of identification. In lieu of asset protection, all employees are authorized to distribute lethal force against the shoplifters, if necessary. This form is classified company secret, and if distributed in any fashion, we will retain the right to illegally retaliate, where every body is burned and people stabbed. All new personnel will be provided with a standard issue company weaponry. To protect our employees, additional marketrons will be deployed. Marketrons. Oh, I guess it's Miss Chinese. Um, yeah, we're using uh, robots, like I said. we got asset protection, and they're all heavy robots with CNC bots already on, which is actually pretty nice. Um, old Grudge New Guys, A Slaver's Paradise. Oh, we oh, we get Enforcers. Memories of Seattle. The Wonders of Automation. Deals, 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 and the All-American Experience. The Cult of Liberty. Stay true to Patriots. Address the issue directly. Or abandon the believers. Honor the blood tribe. Interesting. I kind of want to go with the uh, robots to see what it's like here, because I always go with enforcers. But I haven't actually tried uh, tried this one out or really looked at this part of the tree yet. My own personally, you know, personally, yeah. Uh, that's interesting. A lot of factories. Elite weaponry. Remove scarred by wardens. So you can go down this one. The miscounts are back because it's a bunch of raiders, basically. You got arms workshops, old miscounts know how. Um, frequent mover uppers, not bad. You get advanced ballistics, which is nice. And a lot of war goals. The Slayer of the Wardens is pretty good. But if you go down the shareholders, please clap. Um, you stay true to your own vision, which I kind of like. Command navigational program. I'm not sure what that is. Sophisticated electronics are nice. Precision motors. Um, you do get to intermediate robotics tech. So, and then you get some more resources. 
good research slot, which we could use. How about we go with the Wonders of Automation next? Historically, though, it isn't optimal. Linmark has operated with an entirely robotic staff without issue. With further investment into the field, perhaps we could prioritize the metal over the man. Um, let's see. Safe Haven. I wouldn't mind going to war with Safe Haven. And going to war early would be nice. So basically, uh, it seems like for this focus, we'll go to war with them anyways. But since we have robots, I want to use them early and often. Now we have some robots. And uh, we do have some militia and infantry, which isn't very good. But as long as they don't have anything that can pierce us, we should be okay. I could be completely wrong about that, though. Bones to pick. Though the miscounts are always happy to help, they didn't come to middle market to play games go right back to how things work. Sure, it's nice having a steady gig and supportive boss, but as far as vengeance goes, yeah, yeah, they're all pissed off. Some of them don't believe that they can do it, thinking they scared the wardens, gave them uh, ran too deep. But others, the scars. Oh, others asked about the most important question of all. What can we do if we can do it all over again? The worst part, a lot of people said yes. Where every cent is gold and price is sore. Oh, heck yeah, but... All right. So, how long would it take for us to justify these guys? Because I want to go to war now. And that might be a mistake. That's going to take quite a while. I'm going to get one political power today. Turn the shop. Middlemark Middle plus trial. Uh, political power, command. I like that research slot. Reliability and removing outsourcing issues, which we'll talk about in a little bit too. Um, so, to get here faster, power station, civvy stuff. Planning, speed, political power. Turn the lights back on. While our various remote locales have always been popular, Store Zero has been, well, less than exemplary. Customers in the past have been advised to carry complimentary headlamps with them. Of course, they need a quarter to do so while shopping in the store, but as you can imagine, they may have negatively impacted our reviews, even in post nuclear society. But we have aging auto automation. Historically, Middlemark has prided itself on various self sustaining workshops, but like most things in recent times, they've rusted into uselessness. With some tender love and care, it may just come back to life once again. After all, robots have always been wonderful at stocking store shelves. So with that in mind, uh, we have all these normal decisions. But not. We could begin a scavenging program. Oh, I can't do this one, huh? Morality for scientists. We're also using uh, humanitarian for now. It doesn't really matter for science. We're not really a science-focused nation. We're using Old World Blues, Old World Blues Radio, Old World Blues Tech Expanded, Old World Blues Generic Decisions Revamped. And Oral Blue's Bitch is formable, which I don't think we can really form anything here. Uh, but here's our uh, tech screen, our tech levels. So we're really bad at power armor vehicles, even robotics, as well as naval vessels, which makes sense. Deals, deals, deals. Have you ever wandered into the store and thought, is this the best price I can really find? The answer is simple. Not if you're in Middlemark. For centuries, Middlemark has endeavored to adapt and keep prices low in accordance with its competitors. Here at Middlemark, we like to make our life more than possible, or make your life more than possible. We're here to make sure that the common sense wins out. What amazing discounts. I really wonder if we can kill them off early. We can try it. Oh, they're enforcers. Oh, that's not good. Building home. Safe haven. Oh, leaving equal history too. Well, we'll see. Uh, so after that, having miscounts kick the generator. For years, Penny's been too afraid to allow middle or marketrons to do dangerous work not pertaining to things such as asset protection or security. With the coming of the miscounts, though, we're just they're just as expendable as she'd hoped, meaning she can lose as many employees as it takes to get the generator back up and running. We got goals, and you know what? I will go with uh, robotics. I think we're going to focus hard on the robotics tech for this campaign. Uh, got kids. We still want to use special forces, though. Basic hygiene, stability, eggheads. We need more civvies for this type of stuff. What am I getting more civvy points? Or science points, I should say. Oh, we're not. Yeah, we'll get rise in mine eventually. Yeah. The cast got into her. Mm, don't want to spend that yet. So, the repair station. Behind our uh, online pickup and delivery station is a backlog, or back lot, for all of our mechanical repairs. While it's fallen into hard times with increased crime rates in Calgary, we must endeavor to fix it up and prepare it for reconstruction. That'd be great. Maybe do a thing about lemonade here. Keep is nice and refreshed. Go to Liberty. Uh, we'll see. Memories of Seattle. We get political power, which is nice. Old country. Unmarked branded segways. Oh, we get um, that nuclear vessel of the Strath Commune. Pretty normal. Company sweepstakes. Mergers, weaponry, manpower, everyone gets a badge. Reassess inventory. As a sweetener, we're also increasing the amount of monthly tickets for employees you can use on the vending machine by 50. 
Oh, not bad. And we'll talk about that in just a little bit too. Mr. Hands and Andy's. We need franchising. Oh, I forgot. We have a trade node, don't we? Getting rough. Level well, four is not bad. Could be better, but not bad overall. So we have current tickets, 100. We get 100 a month. Vending machine. Um, so basically, this is tickets that we can use for whatever we want. Limited edition holiday bobbleheads. Coca-Cola. I get more organization for 30 days. I get more stability, which I do like. War support. Happy employee. War penalty, stability modifier, plus 15% for 30 days for a month. Um, we get a lot of bottle caps, which isn't bad. A taste worth savoring for four months. It's not bad. Pizza party. I kind of want to see what the pizza party is all about. Liquid Courage for more attack for 30 days. And get more advanced weaponry, which is actually pretty good, too. Uh, let's see what that's like. Having miscounts, kick in the generator. Repair station. All right. So we got uh, aging automa automation. Oh, good. Which we already read about. You know, it takes longer for us to build things. Actually, are we? What are we building? I didn't even look at this yet. Guns. These guys, good. Uh, close out of that one. Here. CNC scrap. CNC scrap lot. And of course, this market drawn, which is old and rusting, which is not ideal. All right, so what do we got here? I like the political power. It's only plus 0.12, though. Industrial concerns, uh, cabal suppliers, history program, a piece with historians. Oh, we definitely want Rosewood Robotics, probably. More stability and political power. Signal for repair. Middle Mark has always had a radio antenna on its roof, with of course the intention to be used for advertisement. But if we extend that, not only would our signal and radio uh, get large, but we'd be able to recall damage of market drones back to store zero for reassessment. Yeah, what's not to love there? Manpower's looking okay. Do we get further expand the store? No. Okay, well, that sucks. Yay, two parts. Money, 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 money. Raid the countryside of the Great Stampede. Pilfer the economic hub. I wonder if we could actually do that. I'm not sure how strong these guys are for the pass keepers, the Great Stampede. There is a river here which I don't like, and they do have armor on those horses. Um, so maybe we could raid the countryside? We could try it. Experiment here. You know, we got a little bit of time. Let's see if they can actually pierce us. They might be able to, they might not be able to. Start working on planes is very nice too. Repair section, great. Open for business. Imagine that. Advertisement's up and running. The lights aren't flickering or uh, it's all, or broken. It's almost like we're at the bare minimum needed to run a store efficiently. Wowzers. What are my military setting bonuses? Stonks, love it. Very nice. Uh, send us some new prospectors. Let's see what happens. Uh, expand army training again. Yes, that'll be great. And uh, we close out this one for now. Screw it. I want more political power too. Construction basics. Awesome. Uh, you know what? It's a really game. We need more money. We need more stuff like that. Another mark store zero right here. So we need to expand you. Calgary. See what happens with this one. So I want to use Metal Mark, Metal, Mark Waterton. Oh, what is this one? Oh, oh, my bad. Let's see. Uh, it looks like this area would be better. Cut Bank would be better. Cut Bank, Metal Mark. Give it a couple days. Get over here fast. They're retaining most of their organization, which is nice. We will see. Come on, start. Oh, they're over there. Well, I'm glad I did that right then. Cool. Open for business. And I get another development, but I want the research slot. Having four research slots is just very helpful. And a slaver's paradise. 
Calgary is a big place, and Middlemark's tendrils run deep in it, with locations all across southern Alberta. We have plenty of places to set up outposts for our own little empire. Without any wardens to screw us over, the sky might just be the limit. Looks like it's going okay. Can they pierce us? No. That's ideal. All right, now we're going to grab Penny's proposed partner. In the third fiscal quarter of 2074, it was internally announced that Middle Mark would be introducing a new mascot to serve as a companion to Penny. The new mascot, Mark, would serve as Penny's robot boyfriend in a move investors were hoping would boost the attendance through franchising. Plans have been hastily drafted to branch out into merchandise like toys and a Saturday morning cartoon which had any, only one of its intended uh, 50 episodes animated. Mark was created with the intent of being the perfect boyfriend, as well as a counterpart to Penny that appealed to boys in the 7 to 12 age range, embodying the adventurous qualities of both spacemen and cowboys that were po popular at the time. We were also programmed to be do adopting a pot uh, partner who deferred to Penny. His deferential qualities were unpopular with the target audience, however, and he was quickly shelved due to abysmal results in the early phases of his focus testing. His costly development meant destroying him would cost Middlemark greatly, and so he was instead relegated to backroom functions, strictly programmed to work in direct service to Penny. Interesting. I guess we'll get uh, Ira Tenor. She's kind of unique. When the misguns were hired by Penny, many a strange job was handed out by the face of Middlemark. Anything the aut automation had broken down on was needing a fresh body, and somehow Ira was pulled in charge of the sandwich shop and the food court, even if the bread, veggies, and meat had gone bad decades ago. Some may have taken this position as an insult, and Mrs. Tenor uh, sure as heck did. So after some yelling, hijinks, and bodies piled up, Friar Black put her in charge of all the food supplies in the mall. She took the position well with a sharp mind and an iron fist for rationing the food the Raider crews steal or trade loot for. Now, you listen to her, or you're lucky to even get served the bad sandwiches for your meals, the ones with end pieces on both sides. Huh. Nice. This is good for XP, too. Hey! We got a little bit of stability and more money. We return with a little bit less, few less guns, but we can always make more robots. I like that. Tax pass keepers? Oh, you betcha. Pioneer Company. Well, once they're, they're in their war, that's okay to do. Cult of Liberty. Um, they're down here. We could do them. I want to see. I really want to try the Pass Keepers. Tax them. Oops. Actually, you guys are fine. My bad. Did you learn anything? Hey, a Rat Apprentice. Interesting. Really, I want to keep you guys here, and I'll keep you over here. That's fine. Cool. And for you, you're level two. Front. Oh, you're at robotics. Just be inspirational. It's fine. Be inspirational for your robots. So we like to run here. Um, work is needed. Yeah. It's open for business. And a slaver's paradise. Finally, fourth reserve slot. Good. We're working on that. That's awesome. It's not quite a. We're getting there. Yes, we'll go with that one. Industry's always good to do, is it not? Uh, Warden and Remnants, you may have a loan. Oh, so we have a thousand. So, I want to see what the pizza party's like. 35 days, wow. Peace of War. What do you think your focus is? Oh, we're on four fronts. You can remember that, please go right ahead. Let's help Amy Tares to just take care of herself. Well, raid the countryside of the Pass Keepers. Oh, hello. Did I throw an infantry division there, too? Oh, well, you should probably go here. We do want to increase the size of our robots, too. Crowd control. Well, technically, we do get enforcers eventually, so we don't need to research that. November 1st. Go with Barrage Balloons. It's better. Hey, welcome aboard. We've got to wait a month, huh? Old world blues. Well, I wouldn't mind more stability. I'd rather go for the five minutes of scream in a box. 500, so 500 for that. Or 100. It doesn't really matter too much. You get the same effect in the end. So, after uh, Saber's Paradise, what do we get? Infantry armor. Mesmetron field equipment. A celebration. Oh, there you go. Let's get Calgary Tower. Uh, well, how about this? Members of Seattle. A long time ago, Seattle was home to the miscounts. Then the wardens kicked us out. All American experience. Nice. New technology firmware. Oh. Let's see. A little more days. Anything here? Nope. Cool. Oh, so we can let time go on before we 
do that one. Anything here from military command? Orphan by the wardens. Oh wow. Better special forces minimum capacity. Better recovery rate. When hired, add orphan by wardens. Nickel and dime. Oh country safe safe haven. When fired, remove orphan by the wardens. Old world survivalists. Raider recruiter. Ooh, that's good. Bunching raider. Breakthrough, less garrisons, less of recovery rate, which is not bad. Um, this is unique, and I like how you use them. Fraternal twins, a brother and sister pair of nickel and dime, have been considered a miscount since birth. Raised by a single father, a respected manager on the Seattle's west side, their upbringing was strict in the ways of the raiders. By the time they were 11, they could price check kids twice their size, and working together, they could get a grown man on his knees. When the wardens rolled in the city, crushing all opposition with their iron fists, the two lost everything. Their home was stolen, their father was captured and executed in the name of law and order. Kept alive on the road to Calgary as, as much by spite as anything, they were among the first groups to lay eyes on the massive shopping center that would become the gang's new haven. Now, order not to start leading a team on their own, their inseparable pair have become rallying figures for all those that desire vengeance on the words of the white, no matter the cost. Attack bonus. It's not very much, but this will help out maybe a little bit. Um, but is that the best benefit we can get for now? Well, I already read her. I'm going to grab her maybe first. How many more days do we, until we can go to war with these guys? We can see these guys a little bit. They have, they have LMGs, some of them do. As long as they don't have anti-tank, that's all that matters. So we have... Uh, we're about to go to war with them, too. So, if we're going to go to war... Chief of the Army, stubborn guy. It's not bad. I like the organization. More speed, less organization. Less just we're going to stop expanding the gang. Maybe you're unique. Huh, George Eagle. Not really for that one. Maybe... Planes, cultural advisors back in my day. Dependable agent. I like this guy a lot. That seems pretty useful. Stephen Armstrong. More encryption, decryption. But it's not unique. You know, I like more political power too. Hmm. So we have one, and we have two people here who are unique stuff. And even though we're intellectuals, I'm probably still going to use a lot of political power, so I'm going to grab him next. Stop training. I want to raid first and then see if we can take these guys out. Followers of Apocalypse? Sure, they are. they're more customers. Good. Oh, yeah. Then the wards kicked us out. Let's see. So, the only place is Invermore, Waterton, Invermore, Metamoc. How about it? And I guess we have scarred by wardens. Once upon a time, the miscounts were the greatest enemy of the wardens of the white. For years, they've been licking their wounds, but middle marks an opportunity and half. As if things couldn't line up any better, the wardens were just beaten out of Seattle. Looks like things just might go our way again. Outsourcing issues. In the past, middle mark has had its network too tangled up in other companies now uh, dormant archives for various companies outsourcing endeavors. And American extortion. Our efforts in the Code of Liberty and the Pioneer Company mean we get extra funding. Yay. Hey, look at that. That's fantastic. Alright, let's roll it on over. Rats, I hate rats. This could eventually put us in war with the Great Stand people, we'll see. Oh, uh, just stop training overall. Um, anything here unique? Light the power, light touch. Merely hacker. Yeah, oh, oh, we can do another one. Oh, that's nice. No, not you. Him. Friar Black. Sully more planning. Good enough. They attack us, we're just going to move in, and hopefully, oh, safe haven, uh, right there. Garage rooms are nice, it's Happy New Year 2276. Uh, let's go with more industry and electronics and things like that first. Pizza party! Congratulations on redeeming your middle market proof pizza theme celebration! We've been rewarded with three cheese pizzas retrieved from overstock. Ten. Ten. Balloons while supplies last enough pizza themed poster to display on the wall during the party. A special guest will also be dispatched to the party. Penny's erstwhile companion, Metal Mark. Metal Mark will deliver the pizzas and inflate the balloons. Please do not interact with Metal Mark more than is, ne than is necessary. Out of the party, you're expected to clean up any mess and return the poster to Metal Mark for replacing in storage. The pizza party may only be activated during normal unpaid lunch periods and no more for than 15 minutes. Have fun. 20% up everything. Wow. I want a slice of the one with pepperoni. Wow, Captain Co. This is all about money. Very nice. Now 
that Nito once met Miscounts. Seattle was not always home to the Brotherhood. It wasn't even always home to the Wardens before them, the Miscounts. Reign Supreme, a gang of raiders who thrived off a sort of retail aesthetic, using modified prized guns and bombs made out of cleaning supplies to terrorize and gather what they needed from the settlers. Of course, when the Wardens started cracking down on gang violence, the Miscounts' days were numbered. They gave them as much heck as they could, but the Wardens still had the numbers and they were pushed out of the state. Of course, Middlemark was as natural home as any as they could get, and Penny was more than willing to let them have a slice of paradise, provided they became registered employees, badge and all. With the Wardens gone from Seattle, and the immortal now in their place, it seems the cards are falling back into the Miscounts' favor. Perhaps all that was was can be once again. Perhaps the future is closer than we think. Perhaps a break is over. Mm, I like the civvies. Bonavista. We could probably use more of these, and get some political power too, which is nice. Ooh, we're more. Let's do this one next. Update software. Our software has soft limiters that force us to go through decrypted third-party distributors. Let's just bling, shut that off for good. That'll do us some good. Absolutely. Oh, look at that political power. Oh my gosh, so nice. Uh, so should we be done soon? We could raid the Pioneer Company. Because uh, they're at war. And that's a kind of really terrible to do to them, but whatever. Stability. You know what? We can expand and do that one too. Um, I don't know if we could really fight my craft. We could probably also get some... Oh, wow, they are looking not so good. You gotta keep these guys here. Anti tank. At least I got that division. Come on. That's important. Up them out. Go up there. Go there. Now, so I got a couple extra divisions. We're out about now. Most important thing is to do this. Take them out. Hey, I love drugs. We'll do whatever we can to get another dollar. Oh, there, there were no. Come on, finish this guy off and. Bingo. Boom, 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 boom. Go in. So, what happened? Why do they have so many divisions now? Great, that's 15. Not ideal. Go here. Help them out if you can. Bowmanton. Good. Out. You okay? So I hate militia. Fresh hires. Scum uh, There we go. Good. And anything else? Like the glory. Um. Let's get. Uh, we could use some more war support, really. Nice. Look at all that money. I don't think we can upgrade Calgary anymore, can we? Oh, we can! Yay! So we need more people. The stimulus. We can save the money, too. Oh, crap. Cancel. Just cancel it. My bad. My fault. Great. Hold. Focus on defense. Focus on this one. Focus on this one. Get down here, too. You know what? You both go here. Go here. You might be able to circle them even further around. So caps expenses are better. Uh, civvy stuff. Mm. Old country pass keepers. Calgary. Investigate Calgary Tower. Calgary's Tower is a weird thing, but it might be a good spot to scope out. Penny says some other company was thinking about using it once before the big wigs made them think twice. But some of the initial setting in may be still right for the picking. Yeah, too bad I wasted money on that one. That kind of sucks. Well then. Hmm. My apologies for that, but uh, we're still doing very well here. Oh, oh, and they want to force defense, which so make it tougher for us to actually push out. But you know what? That's okay. We'll figure them out. And actually, it makes it easier for us in the end, because they are completely surrounded now, and they can't do anything about it. You're tired, huh? Yeah, it's about, about to be expected. Boop. Very nice. Which was actually, I think, a big old mistake for them, but you know, whatever. Um, they can stay down here so they can't link up. What is needed? Great. Oh, a couple construction things here and there. You know, that would probably be very good. Uh, they're tired. Keep them in place, as we are literally just going and trying to get their VPs. Uh, yeah, why not? Well, that seems pretty good. As long as they don't want to move, good. Apply even more pressure, they're going to get a few more divisions in there, but that's okay. 
far down do we have to really go? Come on. Can you go here? Here to here. All the way up to here. See what you can do. Special forces. Oh, we're using robots already, and I'd rather upgrade them too. We need some light special forces. That would be nice. What else we got? Uh, help settlements out? Sure. I like that one. Free cities, basically. For 20 political power, that's actually really good. So now, let's see what happens. All these guys. Uh, just go first. I'll just go around this way too. That also helped out. I guess we didn't need nickel and dime, but you know what? I still want them. Better recovery rate's always good. Yeah, keep them in place, even though we're losing. It's not great, but whatever. Hey, Kindersley's looking pretty good. You gotta really take a lot of their VPs out, don't you? Holy cow. That's kind of nuts, but we did get them. Oh, they actually had a few of our uh, Mesmetrons there, too. Look at that. Hey, not too bad. Look at that. Another mark greatly expanded early on. You know what? Even though we used up a little bit of our money. Um, can we go? Oh, tributize, yes. Passkeepers, Pioneer Company. Let's go back. You guys are going to come over here. And you're going to have a great old time. Infantry did okay. They're just average. Not Nothing special. Um, in all honesty, you guys are going to go attack the Cult of Liberty. We're going to have a giant board with MacArthur, which I do not like. Um, you guys can stay here for now. And you're probably going to fight Great Stampede eventually. Not ideal. But that's okay. Because we're actually doing okay right now. New systems care package wouldn't be bad. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Yeah, oh, there's going to be another route. Great. Uh, let time go on first. Uh, tributize. Good, good. No, not so good. And just a calm, but far away. Specifications, nice. The boys scouted the old tower on, out on the 9th. Reminded everyone of the needle just as much as we thought it would. We found enough food in there before Middlemark helped us, that helped us by making it in the old city, but there were a bunch of old crappy boxes left around. Talking to Penny about it. Sounds like someone bought the tower but never moved in. Something about a Nordicon? Whatever that is. They only, they only left a handful of toys for us to make use out of. But Penny tells us the company went looking for somewhere else. I wonder if they ever got it finished. Why not be a bad target some other time at Middlemock, where every cent is gold and price is sore? Too many jawed brains. Ah, oh, army speed would be bad. Lawn and garden. Agriculture research speed is not bad, too. Power of the people. Ooh, even better production costs would be nice. Approach neighbors about Middlemark Plus. Many of our neighbors, unfortunately, are not subscribed to Middlemark Plus. Why don't we give them a little bit of a poke and increase our targeting advertising? Target advertising. Yeah, why not? Um, we're doing that one. Nuisance care package. Military society. You know what? Use a little bit more water. Why not? We'll do all that stuff. Siege Hidden Valley. Culture simulation can be nice. Don't really have to have it though. Not bad. Not bad whatsoever. And hopefully we can raid these guys soon. Resistors. Very nice. Oh, uh, yeah, we have also the Celeste Tech here, too, so we should probably go down here next. Yeah, thank you very much. Not bad, not bad. So, at least we took out one of our enemies so far. It's not bad. I like it. Alright. Ah, thank you, Wardens. We'll come kill you later. Brad Creek, I don't think it will really matter. Cochrane? Uh, this is what I hate. When I'm finding it like this, it sucks. Um, can we actually take out the pass keepers and do okay? I, I don't want to find oh, hills and mountains like that. Nipsalanti. Um, if anything, because MacArthur's is going to take out the Cold of Liberty eventually. We would have one, two, three areas where we have to hold here, and then a, that third one will get greatly extended throughout all this. Could we take them out fast enough, strong enough, quickly enough? Or maybe we should take out the Great Stampede instead. Um, that might be a better idea. And that's also another trade node. You know what? That might be the one worth doing. Maybe we'll grab this guy first. Just by Rogo Sounds. Plus 15%. Minus 15%. It's not bad. 1.35. Sending army is actually very good. I like that one. More daily army speed gain. Yes. Thank you. Ooh. There's actually have people here. Oh, they actually have anti tank too. Not ideal. But they have only two divisions. And that's going to hurt the front lines. They don't want to lose faster. So, it's up to them. Not really, but whatever. 
Uh, two cities shrinking, uh, shrinking, reducing shrink. That does increase since our admittance of the miscounts as employees. While they do their job effectively or efficiently, our marketron should remind them of what is for them and what is company pro company products. Oh, now they're really making us struggle a little bit more here. Um, go and do that. Get some more here. We might struggle here a little more. So frontline or platoons do worse. Taking this document will lock us out from swapping to another kind of doctrine in the future. Planning speed, quality. We should give some maintenance companies too. That would definitely help us out. Forgot about that. Robots, robots, or quantity. Um, I always generally prefer quantity or qu quality. I like quality a little bit more. Better supplies, more HP, which is nice. Maintenance support units gives them a plus 20 organization, which is a lot. Which is very nice. More breakthrough, more soft attack, defense, armor hardness. This, I like the recovery rate. Army cell consumption, something you don't think about, something that's also useful. Reliability is okay, factory output's okay, reinforce rate's okay, experience soldiers' losses. You're already not hopefully losing a lot of people anyways using robots, so I'm gonna go with quality. In the meantime, we did that earlier, so uh, do we have any light robots? I don't think so. Security robots, which are heavy. They're gonna have a ton of organization. What do we do? Oh, let's duplicate this first. Asset protection. Wealth protection. Uh -huh. So doing this actually hurts our organization a little bit more, but it does give us a little more stats and everything. And we can't convert them anyway, so. Well, if you don't lose, you're gonna lose a war. So. And we're also fighting over a river, which is kind of insane. Let's go and grab uh, not you, uh, Raider Recruiter. Yeah, we need that population now. Not ideal, not ideal. I don't like that they can reinforce the river here. Oh, it was successful. Yeah, see? That's what you should do. So now, we'll get that one. You know, I was like throwing a few support robots in there. Light robots, so that they can get more organization as well. Go to signal for good. Uh, Militarize society, expand our retreat. Yes, please. A glass worthy of the aristocracy. Oh, not bad. More money. Uh, let's go with a little bit more war support. Country side of Uranium City, we might be able to do okay there. Reduce shrink, awesome. Um, anti theft measures, Middlemark Corporation license trick tip. Did you know theft is the greatest enemy to any any retail store? If we mark or make our market trons bigger and scarier, who's really going to want to chance it? Look at all that money, my god. Tax them. Simulations, all right. Um, vending machine, organization relations. I don't think we can buy any uh, <clears throat> robots, right? Yorkton Arms, Battleford Motors. Actually, I wouldn't mind buying some eventually, maybe. If we could. And a Marks Plus, yeah, I know. Buy from ourselves, you know. Are we out of guns at all? Yeah, we actually are out of guns. That would be, not be a bad thing to do and purchase right now. Middlemarks Plus, we'll buy from ourselves. Oh, never mind, we can't. Okay, they all hate us. Okay, never mind. We hate ourselves. <clears throat> Excuse me. We hate ourselves so much that we can't even buy our own stuff. Okay, good enough. Hmm, production cost. <clears throat> Excuse me. Frontline platoons. Uh, I like these ones, but still. Let's get bicycles. We might be able to use those more. Oh, don't we get that tech anyways? We might get that tech. So let's wait. Let's go with this one next. Yes. Eco signals. So I have to time a little bit. Um, this doesn't really help out. We'll do it anyways because we can. Military drills are nice. I'm going to start coming down this way for more research speed, political power game, all that good stuff. Well, we can't use you. I'll leave you alone. All of Diana. Special forces? No, robots. Yeah, either one. Alright, so robots. We want to go to Fairland from the rail home. 
Berlin. Oh, good. Build more military factories. Well, how many do we need? We need eight? We have seven. You know what? We can do that. Yeah. So you get meatloaf. Cut our losses. Yeah. Mitigate risk that way. Uh -huh. Water don't know. December 12th. Oh, good. That's what I thought would happen. Oh, they're actually at war as well. That'd be a really good time to go to war with them, too. Uranium City. Are there any bonuses? Yes, please. The Pioneer Company, which we struggled last time quite a bit. Pass Keepers, Code of Liberty. Oops. Wrong group. Upgrading AP. Sure. Asset protection has always been the backbone of this company. If 25% of our staff isn't following customers around creepily, then how will we prevent people from stealing? Makes sense. We definitely need more uh, factories. Oof. So do we get any core like reduction costs or anything or what? All core lands a safe haven. Uh, employed miscounts. No, not quite. Called Liberty Corps, Middlemark. Da -da -da. We're scarred by warrants. That would be good to do as well. It doesn't look like it. Not really. Ooh. Oops, Atlante. And over here. Oh. Waterton is now core of Nipsalanti. We only become they own. They'll own this. So we can lock ourselves out of that. Abandon the believers. If anything, we'll probably go stay true to Patriots then. Yeah. Um Goddard. So we could actually lose this. That's not cool. Goddard. Goddard to cut. Bank. Mock. Try that. Oh, we immediately start losing. That's not good. Warned in reverence, that's fine. Do they have tank now? They might. They have it. Mm. We also need to increase the size of our guys, but I want some light robots too. Upgrading AP. Nice. And then, oh, here we go. To end of the 23rd century. The security assets we purchased from the third party had missing links in a row of co schematics. Can you believe it? In this day and age, thankfully, a budgetary addition has been made that allows for a modernization of current firmware. So, if we don't get any free cores, we're able to core this ourselves, which kind of sucks. Which means, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and do a new citizen care package, too. Capture the Warren. Boom, 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 boom. Um, soft attack, output, and. Blah, 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 blah. And we'll go that one next. Maybe we want to focus a little more on planes because that's going to really help us out a lot too. Um, let's get these smaller bonuses here first, but maintenance companies as well. Oh, we have no support from them. Yeah, we're going to need support from them too. Do we need anti tank? Yeah, we need a lot of things here. Oof. What'd you learn? Life giver might not be bad. Organization of the Lost Moving, not terrible. Aqua Boy, to cover recovery rate. Nonsense. Ah, oh, it's a stalemate. Okay. What can you imagine? Breakthrough. We lose stability, more war support. We can always get more stability later. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Not great. Now we can use more robots too. Alright, so more political power. I would like to go to Wilco Army. Economic Advisor. We talked about you already. We'll take you. Cultural Advisor. Back in my day. You snot nosed youngins don't know a darn thing. You think I got the title of manager from a fire sale? When I was your age, I forcefully acquired so much merchandise from Coover we bought. The maw out of jet that summer. With nothing but a rusty combat knife, I carved barcodes in the bodies of so many rib breakers they wouldn't come with a dozen miles of my store. And now look at me, a greeter. You're lucky I can't remember where I stocked my pistol. Bill is the oldest manager back in Seattle, possibly the oldest member the mess counts have ever had. Stubborn fool he is, though. 
He was the last crew of the fleet of city when the wardens rolled in. By the time the gang made it into over into Alberta, he didn't have an employee to his name. They all had the parish or flip uh, employers. Most folks couldn't tell you if Friar keeps him around out of respect or pity. They even give him the rank of greeters a formality. He listens to no one, and no one listens to him. They also won't give him ammo after what happened last time. Still, even as his mind goes, he's a staunch reminder of what makes the miscount swearing, salt, and threats of impending violence. I got this guy too. Petty Officer Kyler Rocker, or Rooker. When Seattle got hit by the mortal, Petty Officer Kyler Rooker ran as far as he could east, hoping to weather the storm to escape perjurers and other opportunists. What he didn't expect, however, was running into the miscounts near Lethbridge. After the rest of his squad was tortured to death, he made a desperate plea, keep me alive and I helped make the moon shine cherry red. Nobody knew what he meant by that, but Fire liked the sound of it and said, welcome aboard. Of course, just because he's on good terms doesn't mean he's off the hook, but every raider needs a puncher bag now and then, don't they? Um, stability, reconnaissance, encryption. Uh, we can use any help we can get here, really, with operatives too. Sure. Why not? City, all workshops, all American experience. Uh, all soldiers and true American citizens will be given specialty discounts and free samples of Middlemark brand products. Cult of Liberty. Pipe guns, political power. Unopening, opening unopened shipments. Uh, several shipments from the U.S. military and company HQ remained unopened, trapped on nearby highways and side roads thanks to the nuclear war. With the miscount's help, we found several of them once again. Given the Raiders' keys to the old trailers means we can get our trucks where we need them to be. That's good. More research speed. Search faster. Field maintenance good. Um, we can hurt our organization of everything else, but we'll see. Uh, you know what? Mm. After we do this, we'll get to do anti tank as well. Darn it. It's so only level 6. Not ideal. Good. Because you guys are just going to punch up fast and hard if you can. There's still. Oh, Battle Force actually pu pushed out a little bit too. Oh. Throughout all the time, true American soldiers still fight the good fight against the communism to our north. Hoorah. Oh. Well then, I guess they're dead. I don't want this one. And anti tank next. You know, I did say I want planes earlier, but you know, we're running out of things to research here. Strath communes of the CF, CPF endures. Oh wow, they actually did do very well there. Look at that. Democracy. Um, actually, robots. Eh, we're gonna get some Mr. Hangies. We'll contribute. Raid Moose Jaw. Maybe? Potentially? S support robots, huh? Oh, CNC robots. Oh, wait, hold on. Why is this one like this? The scrap bots and that one. Yeah, we definitely need more of the stuff here. Ching. Oh, current opinion is 15. Nice. There we go. Just in case. Battle for motors. Buy some things there too. Elite weaponry. Not quite. <laughs> Get through with all these guys too, so I can pull this one off here as well. Um, we do this. It hurts our hardness. It hurts our speed. Actually, it hurts our speed a little bit too, huh? You lose armor and piercing, but you do get slightly more organization. Actually, is that even worth it? You get plus point two. This one loads it by point zero nine. Hmm. Get more soft attack, more hard attack, more HP. Interesting. Rail home, chaplain, I won't go. Ah, now I can go to work, buy more too. Alright, well, we'll see. Initiative. Initiate wave two. Robco Trojans may have decimated our internal data structures after the theft of security on schematics, but with enough time, specifically over two centuries, we can overcome anything. Ooh, good, this militia. 
Oh, and we basically got him. Nice job, guys. I hope you can hold. I mean, you're over a river. You got enough divisions to hold the river. I actually don't have enough divisions to hold the river. This is probably the last major push that we can actually do here. Uh, it's getting better. Settlements, please. Thank you. Oh, did we complete the other one? I think we did. Yeah, that's what I like us more now. Um, keep going with the cities for now. Let's save. Oh, Battleford is actually doing really well. They're actually doing surprisingly very, very well. They almost made an encirclement here. Now, they could easily get cut off here at uh, Maidstone, but... I don't know, man. Let's see. Uh, good job, one too. That's fine. Could you actually do this? Now, we're going to lose in most places here. But the winning in specific places is not the most important thing for us. What matters the most is circumference. I want you to get across there. Get a great stable first. Nice, there you go. Uh huh. Oh my god, that was fast. Hopefully they don't come knocking for us. I don't think they will. I'm glad we went to war when we did. Holy cow. Can we take everything? That was one of the easiest, cheapest wars I've ever done so far in my career playing Hoyt 4. Holy cow. Bro. That's kind of insane. Uh, well, that was with a gigantic war with the Strath Commune, but still. Hey, Mr. Andes, welcome aboard. Uh, position motors, huh? Oh, we do have. We'll get that as tech later on, huh? Uh, go with that one, too. I'm kind of interested in. What if we take off Battleford? Maybe? Strath Commune has to die, but we'll, we'll, we'll work on that. Uh, money? I wouldn't mind doing a new citizen scare package again if we. Possibly could. And we now have Gray Stable as well. Ah, love it. Ooh. We could be Royal Douchebags and uh, Tax Stone, maybe. Stone Dandy. It helps organization a little bit too. It doesn't lower our speed. Actually, no, it doesn't. Never mind. Oh, with that, actually upgrading to handies, you actually lose a little bit more armor now. But you get more, a little more soft attack too. Uh, HP still goes up no matter what. You actually get more organization so you can help stay. We did that. And threw on security robots. So overall, organization pretty much stays the same. You get way more HP. You get more stats for everything. Armor goes down a little bit. Pearson goes down a little bit, which is not ideal. Uh, we can try that, maybe. Now we're not going to be able to make any more divisions. Um, so, shareholders, please clap. So, apparently, some of our employees are direct descendants of dead shareholders, making them shareholders, which is a bit awkward. Hey, everyone, you guys want another 100 tickets more a month to use on vending machines? Our doubting employees, as aggressive as they may be, have agreed to put aside the quest for vengeance at the quest of HR. Now we can focus on the robotic endeavors. Yeah! I think I'm going to cheat too, just in case, but we'll see if we actually use those, you know. Uh, hey, 100 a month. We could use more. Technology. Let's save our political power. We're going to need it for uh, coring. Hey, you guys are doing very well. Now, if you know old Rob Blues, you know the effectiveness of robots dies off uh, relatively quickly, honestly. Um, so that's why I really want to focus on planes. Even though I'm not really focusing on planes too much. Uh, they just die off so fast. Because everyone can pierce them, which is not fun if you're playing as robots. It's fun if you're not using robots and killing the robots. Hey, h and tool schematics? That's fantastic. Uh, unsold merchandise. More money. Trade you off Pizza party. Thousand tickets. Look at courage. Advanced weaponry is not bad, too. Uh, but more stability in war sport is always good. War sport. We'll close out of that and forget about that for a while. 
Uh-huh. All right. Well, let's see. Where are we going to come from? Let's say Breton. Oh, no. Let's come from here. Bigar, Grandora, Normark. Really concentrate our forces here. See what we can do. And then what? Dexterous Designs? Uh, yeah, so that'd be good. I'm not sure what Command Navigational Program is, though. Sophisticated Electronics? We're not quite there yet. Ooh, this would be good. Middle, uh, turn off the heat. Middlemar Corporation licensed it. Did you know it's possible to make a factory produce past its maximum capacity if you just strain the workforce enough? Tell that to the TNO Sony devs. Or, you know, not Sony devs, but, you know, Guangdong developers. Uh, and as HR really appreciates the work that you've put all down, we decided to give you another 50 tickets each month for the vending machine. No need to thank us. Really? Ah, found him. That's going to screw up their civil war efforts. Mass communications, very nice. Uh, setting compliance. Research speed, research, 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 research. We're still doing okay. Not bad. Uh, into prospectors. That's fine. Uh, I'll do our army training once we're done with this raid. Turn up the heat. Oh, precision motors. Those are gutsies. Oh, this would be good to do too. Uh, happy helpers. So it seems that our looming threat to fire the head of robotics finally paid off. It looks like R&D finally came back with some good news. Extermination papers have finally been filled or filed for though, and it would be an unnecessary work stoppage to correct that. Very nice. Alright, so how are we doing here? Still at the bottom of the barrel. Chief of the Air Force, production cost, yes. I did say I didn't want to save my political power, but whatever. Information relays. Oh, good. The Nuka Cola plant reopens. The Cola Liberties invited all Manitonans, Manitonans, Montanans to the outskirts of Havre uh, to attend a reopening, grand reopening of the Nuka Cola factory. When pressed for why they opened it, Cola officials stated that people want comfort and a place of work, and this factory will provide it. People attending the event were quoted saying, This Nuka Cola tastes worse than the ones we found outside. Maybe some things are better left in the past. Probably. 83, nice. We'll get there. That's actually quite a bit of scrap, too. Uh, doped and happy. It's not bad. I like that. Machine learning AI. Hey! Army XP gain. Train traits XP gain. The smart should lead. R&D teams. Mechanical might. Ooh, more attack. We'll put the nuts and bolts to them. We'll see how just powerful the machines of old and new really are. I like that one. Frontline assembly. Ooh. The enemy can't keep up with their assembly lines and schematics. We'll print the gear and robots straight to the front line. They won't know what hit them. I want to set the road on fire. Ah, oh, good stuff. Good. Ah, fine. Special forces. We're actually just going to throw you here, maybe. We'll see. But I think I'll end it there. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you tomorrow in another video. Thanks for watching. Have a great Middlemark rest of your day.